hello everyone hold on there let's deal with this square root of x plus x equals 2 how do i deal with this okay this is what i want to do square root of x equals 2 minus x okay so i have to make one of the unknowns the subject but this time around it has to be the the one with the square root so that we can take the square root of both sides that way the square root will be eliminated so now we have to take the square of both sides rather so here now we have 2 minus x then we square it this is going to go with this and x is equal to 2 minus x to the power of 2 so what i will do now is to write this in two places our x will be equal to 2 minus x into 2 minus x this is called expansion now x is equal to 2 times 2 4 2 times minus x minus 2 x x minus x times 2 minus 2 x then plus x squared that is negative x times negative x is positive x squared our x here is now 4 minus 4x plus x squared. Mind you, we will still need to rearrange. So I write x squared first. Then minus 4x follows. This becomes minus x. And this plus 4 appears. And I equate to 0. Because there's nothing again on the other side of the equation. Now x squared minus 5x plus 4 is now equal to 0. Now, we have a quadratic equation. And I'm thinking already, what method can we use to solve this problem? Okay, from the look of things, we can factorize. So how would you know if it is factorizable or not? You look for two numbers you can multiply to get the constant and you add the two numbers to get minus 5. This time around, the two numbers will be minus 4 and minus 1. Because minus 1 times minus 4 will give us positive 4. Then minus 4 plus minus 1 will give us minus 5. So we are good. Now, the factors will be x minus 4 that is the first factor second factor is x x minus 1 so we equate this to 0 and it means it means that x minus 4 is equal to 0 or x minus 1 is equal to 0 from here our x is 0 plus 4 or x is equal to 0 plus 1 x is equal to 4 or our x is equal to 1 therefore x is equal to 4 or 1 but mind you since both of them are positive do we think that both of them will be satisfying the equation let's go back to the equation and we substitute the equation is square root of x plus x equals 2. Definitely, if you put the first value of x, if we put the first value of x, then we have square root of 4 plus 4 equals 2. And this is already more than 2 because this is 2 plus 4, which is 6. So therefore, x equals to 4 has to be rejected because it is not the solution now let's work with the next value which is x equals one so that means we have square root of one plus one will this give us two the answer is yes because it's, it is already obvious square root of one is one plus one and that is giving us two so this means that x equals one satisfies the equation and the first solution, which is x equals 4, 
does not satisfy thank you for watching if you love my method subscribe to my channel for more beautiful problems like this